Hey guys, so I'm at home today. I'm gonna to do a what I ate today video for you guys. And um, starting off with my smoothie. It's a bit cold for a smoothie, but I'm doing it anyways. <laughs> um, so I've got banana, dates, mango, and cherries. And this is my parents' blender. It's amazing. I love, my new favorite blender ever is a Blendex. So um, yeah, that's what I'm having for breakfast. I will see you next meal. Hey guys, so, uh, I try to include exercise in these videos for you. Um, and as for now, <laughs> this is what I got. <laughs> I'm walking. So, um, yeah, obviously no cycling is happening right now or probably in the near future. All right, sorry, a car came by and that's just a little embarrassing. Anyways, <laughs> um, yeah, no cycling right now. <laughs> and um, I really hate the gym. Every time I get a gym membership, I just let it go to waste. So... I'm walking for now. I'm kind of looking into like some bike trainers to purchase. I don't know if I'm going to do that. To be honest, I'm not really, <laughs> I don't know. I'm not really feeling that either, but uh, yeah, I got to figure something out. But for now, I'm walking. It's minus 15 right now. I have not experienced this in three years and it's very cold. <laughs> so I'm going to stop filming before my fingers freeze off. So for lunch today, I had some potato and leek soup with some mushrooms in it. Um, and on the side, I had three pieces of low sodium Ezekiel bread and a half an avocado, which still leaves my fat intake well within the 10% range. Hey guys, so for dinner, I'm having just some potatoes. So these are like little mini potatoes. I'm going to make both of these bags and have leftover. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to give these a really good wash and, uh, and then I'm going to toss them in some herbs and spices and maybe some garlic. Oh, I'll probably cut them in half as well. Um, and I've got my oven here preheating to 350 degrees. I've just turned it on. I'm back in Fahrenheit. <laughs> so yeah, I'll show you how they turn out. All right, so I've made this paste. Um, it's a whole bunch of different herbs, thyme, and uh, a little bit of paprika and parsley. Really, just whatever you want. It's got a bit of salt and pepper in there with fresh crushed garlic. Um, and then I put in some Dijon and some maple syrup. And I'm going to throw that in the bag with my cut up potatoes here and roast them like that. And I've never done this before. I have no idea how it'll turn out, but uh, yeah, we'll see. All right, so if I had thought about this earlier, I would have done it this afternoon and then let these like kind of marinate. But yeah, I didn't think about that. <laughs> so I've just make this, mixed this around and... This is where I'm trying to do things with one hand that you need two hands for. All right, I'm going to stick this in and probably take about, I don't know, 30 to 40 minutes, something like that. I'll let you know. All right, so these have actually been in for like, oh, ugh, I always do that, <laughs> like an hour. Um, so yeah, quite a while. I should, I always regret not, um, you know, steaming them first or boiling them. But anyways, I didn't. Live and learn. I thought this oven might be better than my crappy one in Melbourne, but it's not. <laughs> and um, I'm eating with my dad. We're having uh, leftover curry from the other night. I just posted a video about this and some brown rice. So he is carving up. <laughs> He's not a vegan, but uh, I don't know. Give me a month or two.